Okay, I finally turned on Uber for the night. I had Lyft running. So on Lyft, like I said, I'm not in the surge. I'm downtown, but I'm just not in the surge area. I did three trips on Lyft already. I did, first was like a little quick Lyft trip. I just grabbed a lady from north, brought her downtown. That's how I got downtown. It was only a couple of miles north. And then I did, so once I got down here, they didn't have a surge. So I turned Lux on because they don't have a surge. Went around, went about a mile, picked this guy up. So it was a mile for the ride. So that was about two miles total for seven bucks. So I did that for two miles for seven bucks on Lux. And then another Lux just came through and I was like maybe a mile from him. So that was a mile and a half for like 6.75. So all my trips down here are real quick. Like I said, as long as they don't have a surge, I'm leaving Lux on. The moment they put a surge on, I'm going back to Lyft. Cause like I said, on Lux, this was like a mile and a half. So I was about a mile away. So 675 on Lux for a mile and a half. But on Lyft, I went possibly like maybe three miles total for 10 bucks. So I'm, I'm doing about the same. As long as it's a surge, I'm gonna do about the same no matter which way I go. So I just need that surge to hit so I can turn it back on Lyft and get off of Lux. And like I said, Uber got a promo right now, 50 rides for 90 bucks. I'm not, I'm not trying to do that. I'm, I'm not chasing that shit because I know what's going to happen. As soon as you start trying to chase one of these quests, they're going to throttle you down. You ain't getting no ride at all. Because like I said, I've been on Uber. Look at it. It's been running, but ain't nothing popped up because that's what they do, they throttle you, they keep you from getting rides, even little short ones right around downtown here. They'll throw you like maybe one every 15, 20 minutes. And if you're chasing a quest, you're not gonna make it, not one every 15 minutes. You need to get a ride like every 10 minutes. You need to be in the car, just going, going, going. Because if you can do four or five an hour, you can hit these quests. You can hit 50 rides in a day if you can get four or five rides an hour, but nah. I'm going to see what I can do with Lyft. Like I said, I got it on Lux right now. Seeing what I can do. Because there ain't nothing, man. It's still kind of early. It's only 1130. It's still kind of early. I got out late tonight. You know what I'm saying? I slept most of the day. I got up, barbecued, slept. I hit the road at about 1030. And that was my first ride right there. Like I said, so, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to have to go till 5 or 6 in the morning and see what I can do. I've been sitting here chilling for a minute. I'm gonna flip this thing over to regular rides because downtown is kind of dead. It's just not late enough. It's, it's been a good holiday. So I'm gonna flip this over real quick to all rides. I'm gonna see if I can get at least, you know, a $15 ride out of here. It's 15 bucks in gas. $15 gotta be less than 20 miles though. Because if it's $15 for like 18 miles, I'll take it. $15 for, you know, no, that's, that's not $15. That's going to Westgate and I'm not trying to get way out there anyways. I mean, 15 bucks, you know, for 18, there's an $11 ride sitting over here. Let's see what that look like. No, $10. No, I don't want that. That's going to Scottsdale. I'm just not ready for Scottsdale tonight. That's just, uh, hey, here's a $17 ride. $17, where are we going? Down south? And... No, and it's got to stop. No, I'm cool on that shit. Nope, nope. If they didn't have that stop, I might have took it, but you don't, these people with their stops are so inconsiderate and disrespectful. They'll be like, all right, it's going to be real quick. And they'll be screwing with you. They'll go in. They'll be just like, man, I'm like, dude, you took almost an hour, dude. What are you doing? Well, not really an hour, but you know, they'd be taking like five, 10 minutes screwing around. And I'll be like, dude, that, that's taking too long for a stop. A stop is like, you know, get out, go drop something off, call it good. Now, nah, all these, I don't know. I'm looking for something that's like $15 for like maybe 18 miles. If I can find something like that, I'll take it. But like I said, nobody's throwing a surge out right now. Without a surge, ain't nobody doing nothing. Ah, that's taking me back to Tempe. Man, I don't want to go to Tempe right now. Do they even have any, let's see if Uber got a surge somewhere. No, Uber don't even, well, Uber's got a surge over in Mesa. So let's see if I can get another one of those going in that direction. No, like the one that I just declined was actually taking me in towards that direction. How close is that? No, that's Scottsdale. Nope. As I'm trying to get to Mesa, let me see if somebody can get me over to Mesa. If they can get me to Mesa or either either Tempe, I'll do it. Cause Uber got a surge over there right now, and I'm not going on my own gas. I'm trying to get somebody to pay me to go over there right now. Another Scottsdale. Doubt it. 
If they threw me a Lux ride for Scottsdale, I'd take it because that'll be about, you know, 25 bucks. But I'm not going there for no $10, $11. Like I said, traffic sucks in Scottsdale. You got to, you know, sit in car lines for 10, 15 minutes just to get in and out of places. And it, it, it's a nightmare. They don't have their infrastructure together. I used to like Scottsdale rides, but I'll do the Old Town part. Five bucks up the road. Mm, nah, I'm not messing with that. Well, fuck it. Let's take it. I, will, I wasn't going to do it, but you know what? I'll take it. She she right up the street from me anyways. I'll go up there and pick her up, but I'm trying to get there. That's what I'm trying to get to. I want to get out west, so I'm going to take her real... I'm going to go pick her up, take her real quick, and let's see what I'm going to do. Who's that? Michelle? All right. I'm going to cut up the road, take her... Man, I hate these little short, crazy ass... Like I said, this is like the bar area down here, so these people, they be tripping sometimes. Hold up. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. That should be grabbing the front of my fucking car. These driveways are steep as hell out here. But yeah, I'm gonna go down here, hit a block real quick, because I'm on a one-way street. That's why I had to go this way. I'm on a one-way street, so I gotta go down, hit a right, hit a right, and I'll pick her up up there. Hopefully she's ready. If she ain't ready, I'm just gonna cancel her ass, and I'm just gonna head out of here. I don't like to wait on people at these little clubs. Okay, I just dropped them off. Now I'm right just north of a surge. There's a surge right below me, so I'm gonna try to pick this up real quick. I'm gonna hit this corner. Like as soon as I dropped them off, now the surge expanded a little bit. Now I'm in it. Let's see what they start sending me. Hopefully they don't send me no BS. Like I said, I'm, that's all I was looking for was to just end up in a surge area so I could take some real short trips. Cause I ain't take, and I had to decline about two trips that whole time because they were sending me some crap like you know 12 miles for like eight dollars like no i'm cool i could do better than that like i said i haven't filled up my gas tank in a couple of days doing all these short trips i like this this is all right let me see what i got i'll see like for my week this is this is how many hours i've actually been driving i got 400 bucks in about nine hours of driving it's not bad not bad like i said i do a whole lot of scouting so it's 16 hours online but y'all know me I don't, nah, I don't play that. It's like I'll sit and I'll just sit and chill. I'm not going to let them play me like an idiot. My book time is what I do. So if you're going to book me for some, book me for some hours. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to be paid to drive. I don't want to be paid, you know, for nothing. So I got to keep that. And that's mainly, that's all Lyft. That's all Lyft. Almost $40 an hour on Lyft. That's crazy. That's crazy. But, hey, that's what you got to do sometimes. You got to scout, kick out the bullshit, stick with the good rides. That's how you do it. You gotta sit online a little bit, but you can go home, sit online, do whatever you want to do. Don't don't take that nonsense though. That's one thing you don't do. But see, fourteen dollars. Where is that? Nope, not doing it. Not doing it. Like I said, I wouldn't mind doing it, but no, I'm cool on that. Cause they need to come up with a two dollar and twenty five cent bonus. Man, they gotta come better than that. Cause I see a circle K up here. I'm gonna hang out this circle K. They took my bonus, but that's cool. I could care less at this point. I'm not going to let you play me out. Now you really... So you should have used the bonus for that trip. I would have, That would have been like 10 bucks for that. I would have took it. But no, you screwed up. You took my bonus, and now you're trying to give me a crap ride. Nope. Sorry about that. You give me my bonus back. Shit. Man, this, this parking lot too packed over here. I got to get out of here. All right. I'm going to go sit at another parking lot. I'm gonna sit across the street from here. Oh, they got me online. All right, I'm gonna go back online. Well, let's see, why do people drive in the lane closest to the damn curb? Like, scoot the fuck over. I hate when people do that shit. They'll drive down a whole fucking street in the in the right lane, and the left lane is wide the fuck open. It's like y'all gonna clip the front of somebody's goddamn car driving in the right lane. Scoot the fuck over. Nope, not doing that one either. Like I said, they should have gave me my bonus, man. They should have gave me the bonus. Tell you what, I'm going to go back on Lyft, on Lux real quick. Because I'll go back on Lux. That way, if they got a short ride, they can actually pay me worth something. Because they ain't got no bonuses out. And if you ain't got no bonuses, I'm riding on Lux. Shit, that's how I get my money right there. So let's open up Uber, see what Uber's got. See if they got a bonus sitting somewhere. They might. No telling. Let's see. 
Uh, nope. Man, it's like midnight and there ain't nothing out there right now. Lux, $18, Scottsdale. Nope, not going to Scottsdale. Sorry about that. I said, I'll go to Tempe or I'll go to Mesa. I'm not going where it's heavy traffic. I'm just not doing that shit. No. And that's what they want to do. They want to get drivers up to Scottsdale because they know them Scottsdale, you know, riders are paying big money to get out of there at night. And they're like, hey, let's get drivers up there. No, they need to get their infrastructure right. I'm not messing with them. People up there, they, you know what I'm saying? They, they be packed. It'd be like 10 cars in a little ass area and everybody just sitting there. Nobody know if they go left, right. People with their hazards on. Nah, no, it's, it's too much. It's too much. I don't do Scottsdale. Back downtown. And they've got some good rides for me. Let's take that. I like that. All right, let's go get this. Like I said, I'm, I'm doing all these little quick short hops because that's where the money's at. I'm not doing no. They be sending me, you know, they just sent me a ride. I think it was 34 miles, $19. <laughs> and it was with a 250 bonus. It was 34 miles for $19. And I'm like, yeah, okay. See, that's why I do short trips. Short trips, you can kind of double your double your money per mile with these short trips. Them long trips ain't worth it. Not on these basic tiers, these foundation tiers, it ain't worth it. You got to get, you know, got to get it up there. Like, if you want to get $3, $4, $5 a mile, let's keep taking short trips. That way, like I said, I still got a half a tank of gas, and I've been driving since yesterday. I ain't been doing nothing but short trips. Serious, I started tonight out with a half a tank. I'm still at a half a tank. Like I said, I ain't using no gas to make this money. None. That's how you got to be, though. Let me hit this corner real quick. Okay, they used two rides to get me away from downtown. Downtown is right behind me right there. I got Lux turned on right now to keep them from giving me another ride till I hit this bonus area. Because usually Lux is like my pause button. Now that I'm off pause now, I can go into my rides again. And I can go back to Lyft and see if I can get me another short trip for high dollars. Bam, bam. Let's go. Now let's see what they're going to send me. They got to send me, you know, something under five miles or something headed back towards downtown. I'll take it. Um, nah, I don't want that. Nope. Nope. And that's just north of downtown, but I'm like, no, nah, I don't want that. It, it's not good. Didn't mean to turn the button off. I got to move my little record down a little bit because they put the record stop button right where the damn lift XB. So... I'm sitting right here on 51st, so right now I'm gonna try to cruise, sit at this gas station right here on the corner, see if I can get a ride back towards downtown or get like a quick short hop. But yeah, I'm not doing no long trips. If, if it ain't, like I said, at a dollar a mile for most of these trips, it ain't worth it. Not on lift, it ain't worth it. So look at that, 10 miles for 10, no, that ain't even worth it to me. I mean, that's 20 minutes of driving with a $2 bonus. That's basically eight dollars for ten miles. I don't, I don't like that. So they got to give me something shorter than that. If they want me to take it, give me a short trip. You know, something that's like about four or five miles, and I'll do it. But all this long shit, I'm not doing none of that. Definitely not doing that. Hell no. That's way the hell out. So yeah, they they getting it together. They trying to figure it out. Oh, I don't have a bonus no more. What? What? They took my bonus away. Well, you know what that means. Time to go back to Lux, goddammit. Next week, I might be back on uh, Lux because I'm not doing this. Nope, wrong direction. Sorry about that. Hey, that was in the wrong direction. And they don't have me in a damn... Yeah, I'm still in the bonus zone. Okay, cool, cool. I got a $2 bonus. Yeah, they got me going in the wrong direction. I'm not going that way. I'm headed towards downtown. So, Lyft, if you're listening to my device like you normally do, I'm trying to get to downtown Phoenix. My next ride should be to downtown Phoenix. What's that? Up north there? I could take that. I'm out here anyways. Let's do something short like that. All right. Cool, cool. So, go up the road real quick pick this guy up i'm at least headed back towards phoenix so it's not horrible oh, i hate when that happens damn oh this is vehicle missing key i'm going to change my key fob out 
shit irritates me. There we go. All right. So let me go pick up Morgan. Hopefully, they'll send my butt back downtown. All right, so I just dropped him off real quick. Like I said, these are all quick little trips right here. Like he's trying to send me rides. I'm right next to a 350, so I'm gonna head over to this 350 real quick. Let's throw Lux on, bro. Lux. There we go. That way they don't, they can't throw me nothing. I got a chance to get out there. Look at that last ride. Look at that. Oh, I got two tips. That was a $2 bonus. That last ride, you know, 251, five miles. Like I said, that's the best you can do. And I was right around the corner from him when I got him. Y'all saw that. Then that one there, that was, you know, five bucks. They caught me on that one. They threw that one on. But dude was cool as hell. I got him to the house or whatever. He was pretty cool. So, like I said, I'm, I'm only doing rides. They got bonuses and shit like that attached. Otherwise, I'm not messing with it. They're going to they gonna have to lux me up. Lux me up that fucks me up. All right, let me turn this corner right here. McDowell. Ooh, I could keep going straight. Nope. Doubt it. Look at that shit. 36 miles. Man, they out there goddamn mine. $28 for that shit. You give me $60 for that. But see, I'm trying to do short rides. They know I can get more per dollar. Now, like, that wasn't even a dollar a mile. That ain't even a dollar a mile. Look at that, 18, nah, I'm cool on that shit. I'm trying to get $7 a mile, man. I'm downtown, I'm not fucking with y'all. They know it, 780, let's do it, shit. That's what I'm talking about. Cause if I'm gonna do this shit, I'm, I'm getting high dollars per mile, I'm not fucking with them. It's like, I'm not gonna be sitting here doing less than a dollar a mile, but I can just do short rides all day and make bank. <laughs> it was like, you gotta kick out that dumb shit. Don't do that dumb shit, that's less than a dollar a mile. A lot of time, a lot of highway. You don't want to do all that. Just keep picking up these little short rides, make them throw the surge on there. And this one I think is headed towards downtown anyway. So they're going to have to add 450 to everything. So I'm going to be getting like $3 a mile for everything I do. Now, if you do a 30 mile trip like they just sent me at $3 a mile, that should be $90, right? So you want me to do a 30 mile trip? Give me $90. Don't give me $28. Give me $90. You short $70. It's like, come on, man. Let's, let's make this, let's make it business. Let's do this the right way. So let me head over here, pick him up real quick. Alonzo, I'm going to uh, end this recording. I'll start it back up in a second. I just want to listen to my music. I can't listen to music if I'm doing this. I just dropped him off downtown and then Lip tried to throw a ride on there. It was a $10 ride to Tempe like this. They're trying to throw this on there. They trying to get me to go to Tempe or something like that. I'm not taking them rides. I'm right in the middle of downtown. All good money down here. Like I said, I'm not going nowhere. Nope, not going nowhere. Look at that, 22 miles. They trying to get me out of downtown bad. Like, nope, doubt it, doubt it. I can make $6 a mile, something like that. $5 a mile just hanging out downtown. Look at that. Nope, doubt it. They trying to get me out. I'm like, nah, man. I'm, I'm right where I want to be. Y'all done screwed up. Keep my ass downtown. Nope, doubt it. They not paying me enough per mile. I'd rather just do these short trips. Give me another trip of like a mile, two miles, I'll take it. Cause it'll keep me right in this area. And that's a $5 mile, $5 ride right there. Look at that, nope. They, they trying hard to get me out of downtown cause they know I'm down here making this money. They mad, they like, damn it, he's got, he's back. Yep, only need 10 more rides. Oh shit, I could do 10 more rides in two hours. Get that 50 bucks, get all that money. Nope, doubt it. They gonna be like, man, this dude's damn AR is like 1% damn straight. It's like, I'm not taking nothing. Look at that. Man, they really trying to get me out of downtown. They trying to get me far from here. They don't want to pay me that $50. <laughs> Look at that. Nope, doubt it. I'm getting rid of all of them. They got surges sitting over there in Tempe and Scottsdale. I could do those rides. If they get me to Tempe, I might do it. But these rides, they're not really worth it to me. Nah, I'd rather not. Like I said, for two bucks, look at that, seven miles, nope. I'm kicking them all out. Other drivers can have that shit if they want it. I'm looking for high miles. I mean, high dollars with low miles. That's what I'm looking for. I'm not looking for long ass trips. They gonna keep sending them to me and I'm gonna keep kicking them out. Cause that's not how I'm driving tonight. They gonna take my they're gonna take the surge away from me in a minute and I'm just gonna throw Lux on. Hell no. 
Man, these trips are nuts. I mean, they got nature hikes going right now. Goddamn nature hikes. People going way the hell out. Nope, not doing those either. Like I said, they, they're not throwing me no short trips whatsoever. Give me a trip to Tempe and I'll take it. Give me a trip to Tempe. Like, is Tempe still surging? Yeah, give me a trip to Tempe, I'll take it. But not Scottsdale, definitely not Scottsdale. I'm trying to find somewhere to fucking park. Nope, not that either. That's wrong direction. I'm going east. If you, I mean, yeah, take me east. Take me to Tempe. I'll do it. But no, I'm not. Give me either a super short trip or ride the Tempe. Where is that? Twelve dollars for that? No. Like I said, that that wasn't good enough. They they miles are jacked up because they they got a surge and they pay me less than a dollar a mile. So I don't want to do that. What's this fourteen dollar ride? What's that about? Oh, hell no. Definitely not. Definitely not that either. It ain't no fucking where to park around here. Man, I don't want in a big ass circle. I'm just looking for somewhere to pull over, man. I can't, I don't want to keep driving all fucking night. What's this $14 ride about? What's that? Oh, I already saw that. Yeah. Yeah, not that one either. You no, knew. No. Nope, not that one either. Like I said, they keep throwing these weird ass rides out. These rides are way too far out for me. I'm not, I'm not trying to get out to them places. Where is that? Where is that? Where is that? It's almost Tempe, but not quite. And the miles ain't right anyway, so nope. Yes, found me somewhere to park right here. $12, nope. Like I said, I'm looking for something like three, four miles. Three, four miles, maybe. And they know it, too. Because they like, this dude, he's about to hit this damn bonus with these rides. 27 miles? Yeah, doubt it. Don't think so. Like I said, those are all... I would take those on Lux, maybe. If they paid me like $50, $60. Ooh, yeah, let's take that. Wait a minute. Then I'll be four miles up. No, I don't want that. I don't want that. Give me something shorter than that. Because right now, is the surge is kind of going up a little bit, and I don't want to do that right now. Nope. Nope. they like, man, this dude ain't taking shit. You're right. Because look at all that surge over there. Get me over to Tempe. I'll take it. Check that shit out. We're going to Tempe. Let's go. Bam. <laughs> Let me go pick up B. What up, B? Thank you for taking me down the street. All right, so me and B are headed to Tempe. Let's go, because they surging out there pretty good. Let's go get this money, Miss B. I'll hit y'all up in a minute. Yeah, I got down to Tempe, did that ride to Tempe, picked up another ride. As soon as I turn the app back on, look, they have me and no surge around me. There's all this surge, they got me and no surge. But I just did a, a quick ride real quick. I just dropped off Hope right here. So I got a little, you know, it was six miles almost, but it was, she was right around the corner, eight bucks. I don't like that ride because in the surge area, I could have got better, but they just threw that shit in my queue. I could have got a three mile ride for that price. And I'm sitting there doing a six mile ride at that price. So I'm, I'm kind of mad about that because they didn't give me time to cherry pick. They threw that shit in my queue too fast and I couldn't get rid of it. So, let me go back and this was the other one i did right here that's this is the one that got me to tempe right there that was that long one that got me to tempe not horrible because i wanted to be there but as soon as i get to tempe they give me the, a crap ride they give me that shit right there six miles for eight bucks and like i said the bonus was 275 so it was a 553 for five miles and like i said i was right around the corner when i dropped her off i didn't have to go nowhere but you know what it it wasn't a good ride i need three miles not six miles so I'm headed back north a little bit. I at least want to go like maybe, you know, a half mile north, get into the surge zone so I can start cherry picking again. Hopefully they don't try to take, send me to Scottsdale on the first damn trip. Keep that shit low. Keep it low. Give me low miles, baby. No whammy, big money. No whammy, no whammy. <laughs> Let's make a deal, damn it. Let's make a deal. No whammy. All right, crew. I'm almost up on that 650, which don't make a difference. Nope, doubt it. 
Look at that shit. I knew they was gonna do that shit. Man, that's like 10 miles. No, I'm cool on that shit. I know exactly what I knew they was gonna try to pull that shit. Send me the Scottsdale. I'm looking for short shit. I don't want that. Cause 22 bucks, like I said, I can make eight dollars and a half mile, but you're gonna pay me twenty-two dollars for like ten miles. That don't make sense. I just made eight dollars and a half mile. That's what I'm looking for. Eight dollars a half mile, not twenty-two dollars for ten miles. I mean, I would take it if it was a slow night. Hell yeah, I would take it. It's two dollars a mile. Who wouldn't take it? But this shit right here, this is a lot of money. So you can't be taking no long trips when you're in a zone with a whole bunch of short, short money. Take all the short money you can get. When this shit dry up, now you can go take the long trips. Because it's not dried up yet. It, it's, this is just about to start popping. So I'm going to kind of hang in this area, do as many short trips as I can, get it popping. And then when it all dries up, I'll long trip myself out of here. But, yeah. I'm going to hit this turn right here real quick. Skirt. Yeah, I'm at 650. Oh, perfect. And I love it because right now I'm at a I'm at a, a arrow at the light, so I can't turn. So I gotta sit here. So I'm gonna sit here and kind of kick back for a second. Let me see some. Oh, that's my pup. Oh, I was showing them girls my dog because I was trying to show them because they she was like I got this kind of dog. So I was showing her Dash. That's my buddy right there. And right, let's see what Uber's got going on. Because if Uber got some money jumping, I'll jump over on Uber for a minute while Lux is kind of dragging their feet. What 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 they got over here? What they got? Ooh, look at that, 1114, let's go. What are you talking about over here, Liv? What are you talking about? Shit, <laughs> you got your damn mind. Hell no. What Liv talking about? Oh, hell yeah, I'll take that, shit. Two miles, six bucks? Are we right up the street too? Damn it, I'm in the wrong fucking lane. Urgh. They always do that shit. I'm in the wrong lane, man. Fuck. Set the trip by accident. My bad. Sorry, dog. I'm in the wrong lane. I'm in the left turn lane and they got me going right. So I can't do that shit. Yeah, I'm not doing that either. Yeah, see, I don't I don't do that shit. I don't fight my way through traffic. I flow with traffic. So if I'm in the wrong lane and you to the right and I'm to the left, I can't fuck with you. I'm sorry. I just can't fuck with you. And there's no disrespect to you and your ride or whatever, but I'm just, I'm in the wrong lane for that shit. They put, they sent me a ride in the wrong direction from where I'm going. So, yeah. Like that, $19 for that? No, it's not good. It's not good right there. $26 for that? See, that's not good either. These rides are, if it was dry right now, I would take those rides if it was dry. But it's not dry enough for those rides. See, it's, it's, this area is booming right now. Damn it! Ah, see? I didn't mean to hit that shit. Sorry, Emma. My bad. Sorry, accepted by accident. Like I said, I was trying to hit that, that damn button. 13 for 8. Nope. It's not good enough. I don't like that. Because that's taking me all the way back up to Phoenix. I'm not trying to get up to Phoenix right now. I'm trying to stay right where I am. What they talking about up here? Nope. Too far. Like I said, I'm not doing no fucking long shit. 725 bonus here. Seven dollars here. I guess who who's got the best deal coming up? Nope, 12 miles away. I'm not trying that. 10 miles away, 12 miles away. Nope, not doing either of those. Neither one of those trips are good for me. Is that they're too far? I mean, I need something under, you know, three miles. There's there's a lot of little quick trips around here right now. They just got to get it set up right. Nope, doubt it. It's too far, way too far. That's it. How are they doing over here? Let's see. Yep, 750. I'm sitting on 750. Not bad. Uber, I'm almost up to the 11 right now, which is not bad, but like I said, I'm at an 850 on them. What do we got up here on, on Lyft? What do we got? Come on, let's go. Nope, too far. Nope, not doing that shit. Yeah, 775. It's too many short trips that I can take around here versus taking these long ass trips. I'm not taking them long ass trips. Mm, nope, not going to Scottsdale. What about these motherfuckers? Where are they going? Nah, 
nine miles for 15 bucks? No, no. Nope, definitely not. And that Halifax and Mason, no. Nine, no, that's not. I don't like that trip right there. And they giving you eight fifty, which means seven dollars for nine miles, almost ten miles for seven dollars, which is not bad, but it's not what I'm looking for. Uh, shit. Nope, I'm not looking for that either. That's that's too far up. I need something shorter than that. Give me three miles, four miles, I'll take it. Three or four miles, I'll take all this long shit. I'm not taking. Cause like I said, I'm in a good area right now. This is a money area right here. See something like that I'll take. I like that. I could do that shit. That's a good that's a good ass trip right there. It's nine dollars for like a mile. So let's do it. I'm, I'm right around the corner from this person. So let me cruise over here, pick them up real quick. Let me turn Uber off. Let me get out of Uber offline. Well, I could save that surge. I could save that surge under Uber Pet or some shit like that, but I don't want to risk, you know, somebody fucking hit me up on Uber Pet. And I'll be like, God damn it, they hit me up on fucking Uber Pet. I'd rather do $9 for one mile. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, let me turn this corner real quick right here. Oh, shit. They got his ass around the corner. These dumb motherfuckers, man. They got me on the wrong side of the fucking building. That's why I hate these goddamn maps. Dude is on the other side of the fucking building. Man, look at that shit. He's way up over. Let me go around here. These fucking maps is whack. Let me go pick him up real quick and I'll hit y'all back. All right, that was a pretty quick ride right there. Bam. Like I said, I was right around the corner. Picked him up. $7 bonus, 1.7 mile nine. That's what I was looking for. So all those $20 rides for 20 miles and, and $15 rides for 13 miles. No, you could get $9.81 for like less than two miles. You just got to know how to do it. You got to keep cherry picking. You got to know how to do it. I'm, I'm looking at low miles, high dollars. That's the trick. Because you don't want to be, oh man, it's a $25 ride. Yeah, but it's for 20 miles. I mean, if I got, if I do 20 miles at this, I mean, what? That's $90. 98 $98. If I did 20 miles at this rate, that's $98. So why would I want, you know, I would rather take the $98 other than taking the $20. I don't want the $20. I want the $98. So I'm looking for a really short trip for a high dollar amount. And that's kind of how I drive, you know what I'm saying? And I know they got other rides in here right now. I think I'm in a bonus zone, but I'm kind of far away. Yeah, I'm still online. I'm in the bonus zone right now, 350. I'm headed back towards, like I said, I'm only like a mile down the street, that's it. So I'm gonna head back over here and see if I can get this fucking money. But that's the trick, man, that's the trick right there. It's 2.30, I can go back on Uber, see what Uber's throwing out at me, but like I said, and everybody's like, man, you only made a hundred bucks for the day. Yeah, but I probably only drove like 20 miles too. <laughs> You've been driving nowhere all day. This is a bunch of short ass trips. Like when you getting, you know, $10 for going goddamn two miles, you can't beat that. You can't beat it. And I'm not gonna sit up there and be like, yeah, I, I want 25 miles. I mean, $25 to go 20 miles. I don't want that. That's That's not what I'm looking for. If I'm going to really maximize this money and do this shit the right way, then you need to maximize your shit. Let's see what we're talking about. Look at that. Five for five. Uh, no, nah, let's not do that. I could do better than that. I mean, it was it was a decent trip, but I could do better than that. Because they can give me something shorter. They can give me something under, you know, three, four miles. They don't have to give me that. Because that was almost, you know, six miles right there. And I'm like, I could do better than that. Uh, what I got? Seven more trips. Seven more trips and I get 50 bucks. I guess I could start just doing regular shit to hit, get that seven trips. Oh, let's do it. Let's do it. All right. I was going to turn Uber on. But if all I need is seven more trips to get that 50 bucks, let's, let's do that. Let's just focus on Lyft for right now. Yeah, but let's not focus on that. That's a little too far for me. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying. $18 for 22 miles. I just did $9 for like two miles. So why would I want 18 for 20? It don't make sense to me. Look at that, 18, I just did, nah. 
See, that's the thing. I don't want those trips. Those trips are, if somebody lives up there, this is a busy area right now. It's a lot of people, and this is where all the students are partying. So all the students are partying. All the students need to get home. And once they start going back to the dorms, because they're drunk, they don't want to walk. So they got to pay me. So I'm like, fuck it, let's do it, man. $10 a trip, $10 every two miles, three miles, whatever. Let's do it, shit. Because that way I don't have to take these long-ass nature hikes at a dollar a mile in the middle of the night. I'm doing all short trips. I'm right in this area right here. I'm not going nowhere. And Lyft is going to keep sending me trips. If they send me seven more trips that are short, let's say each trip they send me, if it's even two miles a trip, I can go 14 more miles tonight. 14 more miles, make $50, plus get whatever they're paying me for each of those trips. So why not just go for 14 miles? I could do 14 miles over the next seven trips instead of doing one trip for 22 miles. I don't want to do one trip for 22 miles. I want to do seven trips for 14 miles. If those seven trips each pay me, let's say five bucks, that's $35. $35 plus the 50 make $85. I went 14 miles and made $85. 14 miles of driving to make $85 versus going 20 miles to make, you know, $18. That's how you gotta think about it. You gotta you gotta do the math real quick. And I know people say, well, you're wasting time. I don't give a shit, whatever, man. I'm about this money. That's all I'm about. Calculating what it's gonna take me to make that much money in the least amount of miles, least amount of time as possible. What can I do? Let's do the 14 miles. Seven trips, two miles a piece, even three. Let's say 21. I'll go three miles, 21. 21 miles, I can get 21 miles. Let's say that's $7 for each of those, or Let's say six dollars, so that's forty-two dollars. Six dollars each trip, seven trips, forty-two dollars. Add the fifty, that's ninety-two dollars. Let's do it. I think I can do it. I think I can. See shit like that? Oh, you motherfuckers, man! You motherfuckers. Five miles. I'm not doing that. I'm just not going up there. I'm just not. They 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 pissing me off now. Cause they know what I'm. They know what I'm trying to do. And they're giving me all these crap-ass trips right now. I'm looking for short trips. I don't even want five miles. That's, that's not good for me. I'm looking for something much shorter than that. Much shorter. And it's, it's there. The trips are there. They just got to give them to me. See? Not looking for that either. That's, that's going back towards downtown. And then this probably ain't shit going on downtown. I was down there earlier. I mean, they, they paid me... $11 to get here, but they give me $10 to go back with the bonus. That shit don't make no sense. I got $11 to go from downtown to Tempe, but you're going to give me $10 to go back with the $3.25 bonus. Yeah, that ain't happening. That ain't happening. You're trying to rip me off now. Now you messing with me now. So what I'm going to do is I'm right about here. I'm going to pull into this Jack in the Box parking lot right here and wait till I get my my three mile trip like I said even if I don't get it tonight it's cool I can get that shit tomorrow nope doubt it like I said this is what I do you know you gotta you gotta learn how they work these apps you know what I'm saying everybody's like but you only made $98 on the day I've driven a quarter of a tank right now a quarter of a tank of gas probably cost me $15 maybe so I've made $100 off of $15 so far that's the way I look at it. $100 off of 15 bucks. So that means if I do that four times, you son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Fuck it, let's go south. I'd rather go south than north. Let's go pick up fucking Emily. I'd rather go south than north. Because north is Scottsdale and I'm not trying to do that shit. Nah. All right, I was pulling up and the lady canceled. I didn't even get a cancellation fee. I hate that kind of shit, but that's cool. That's cool. I was kind of iffy about that ride any damn way, so I don't feel too bad about that cancel. I was feeling iffy. I wanted a shorter one anyways, so that's just how life is. That's how life is. 10 hours, 46 minutes of driving, and I'm almost at $500, which is not bad. That means you can do, if I was to do 24 hours of driving, which is two days of full shifts. That's a thousand bucks in two days doing lift, basic shit. And you know what? These motherfuckers are out there, goddamn mind. I'm not doing that shit. Y'all, y'all fucking mind.
like I said, I, they they know exactly what they're doing. They know these short trips, these trips, you know, only a couple of miles here, a couple of miles there. That's what we're looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Right there. That shit. Let's go. I'm not looking for nothing long. I'm looking for this short shit. Let's go. Let's go. Did, did it give it to me? It didn't give it to me. I don't want that one either. I'm sitting my ass right back to where I was. Nope. Parking this bitch. Because I took the first one. They didn't give me the first one that I took. There. I'll take that one. I took that one. There. Okay. Let's go. Shit. It's like when I took the trip the first time, they didn't give it to me. They made me re-get re it. So I'm headed down to go pick up Erica. Let's go do this. Take her a couple of miles. I'm still in the same area and keep doing these rides over and over. Okay, I just dropped these girls off and now I got to go pick up this motherfucker. Let's do it. Oh, man. It's like non-stop rides. Non I got to go pick up Steven. But this is the thing right now. I gotta hurry up and clean out my back seat because this bitch was sitting on the fucking ground and got her dirty ass in my back seat and I got dust all in my fucking seat. Fucking dusty ass motherfucker. So people, do me a favor. God damn. If you sitting on the fucking ground, at least dust your ass off before you get in somebody's car. God damn. Shit's fucking stupid. Stupid. And we got other people to pick up. We don't just pick up you and that's it. So if you on the ground, get up, dust yourself off, get yourself from being all dusty and shit, and then get in the car. Because the next person might be trying to go to dinner or do something nice or whatever the fuck, keep their clothes clean. They get in and they all the dust you just laid on on the sidewalk, whatever the hell you was doing, now it's all in my back seat. Like, this ain't just your car. This car is a right share. There's other people that have to use this car. So be considerate of the people after you. Clean yourself off. Jeez, man. Shit's irritating as a motherfucker. Irritating. And I think this ride is at goddamn Banner Hospital. Yup, Banner. Motherfucker. <sighs> right after this, I got a... I swear, lip is messing with me now. So I just picked up some dusty bitches. And now I got to go pick up motherfucker at Banner Hospital. Man, y'all messing with me now. They really they really try my patience to get this goddamn money. Hopefully this is like an employee. Yeah, I hope it's not some decrepit motherfucker about to walk out the hospital on crutches and shit and can't get in the car. Because that shit will happen to you at 3 o'clock in the fucking morning. That will happen to you. Picked up from the hospital. He was actually pretty cool. His name was Stefan. He actually got hit by a car earlier tonight. He was on his bike and somebody ran him over yep somebody ran that dude over on his bike man crazy hit and run and they don't even know who did it was a white pickup that's all they know was a white pickup white pickup hit this dude kept going mangled his bike up and everything he was wearing a helmet he said that's the only thing that protected him was that helmet but man that shit they these people out here are nuts the way they drive out here is crazy heartless well i got my app on lux right now anyway so it's on lux because I'm not doing any uh, lift pickups. Look at downtown Phoenix is blowing up. And I'm still down in Tempe. But yeah, that, that was crazy. That's crazy. But here we go right here. That was just him. I had a 250 bonus. You know, it wasn't that far. It was right around the corner when it picked him up. So it was probably about total almost six miles for $7. It's not bad, but it was 487 for going four miles. Then they gave me that two, 250 bonus. Yeesh. These bonuses just ain't, they not getting there. Especially at this time of night, you need to be adding up a little bit more, a little bit more. I've been on the road for, yeah, book time, 11 hours, almost 12 hours to make 500 bucks. It almost took me 12 hours to make 500 bucks. That's not bad. Cause that means in 24 hours, I can make a grand driving lift. And that gives me hope. 
because if they screw up with Lux or they're not doing Lux rides or this and that, I could still make a thousand dollars if I drove in two full days. So a thousand bucks every two full days is not bad because that means in four full days, four days of driving, 48 hours, you might be able to make two grand in 48 hours. And that's driving the foundation rides, that's base tier. Base tier, 48 hours of driving and you can make two grand. That's not bad, that's not bad, you know? And like I said, it, it makes me happy. I'm not gonna do the shit, but it makes me happy to know that it's possible. That's all, it's possible. If I need to, if, if push come to shove and I gotta get out and make a quick 2,000 bucks, then I know, hey, let's get my ass on this app. I got 48 hours to make two Gs, 48 hours, let's get it, let's get it. And it, it might take me, you know, all week, but I'm, I could do 48 hours of driving and make that 2,000 bucks, cover whatever I gotta cover and move on to the next. And I don't have to do Lux, because like I said, Lux, you can get there with Lux, but man, you're gonna be going through a lot of fuel, a lot of miles on this road. With Lyft, like I said, I've been, I've been driving Lyft so far, three days on the same gas. I got 91 miles left till empty. So even if I did, let's say three miles, trips three that's 30 trips i can do with 91 miles with 91 gallons of gas or 91 miles still empty i could do 30 trips at three miles a piece and if each of those trips each of those 30 trips paid me let's say seven bucks that's 210 dollars i can make off this gas i got left in my tank and it's about a quarter tank right now i can make 210 dollars off this 90 90 gallons right here or 90 miles still empty that's, that's not a bad way to analyze how to do this business. And that's kind of how I break it down in my mind. A lot of people like to say, I just like to get out there and just drive nonstop. That's, that's cool if you want to drive nonstop, but I got to have a, a process, a plan. How am I going to make this money with the fuel I got in my tank, with the miles I got left till empty, driving as less miles as I can to get as much money as I can, creating huge profit margins for myself, because I know the app is not gonna create the profit mark. They'll try to pay me $18 to drive 20 miles when I think I can make $18 driving like five miles. I think I can do it, but it's gonna take me to make $3 a mile. Like I said, you've seen me make $7 a mile, $8 a mile, $10 a mile, I've done it. But the consistency in doing it is the hard part. You gotta learn to cherry pick, kick out a lot of rides and shit like that. Let me go back down because there's no Lux rides out right now. So let me go back to Lyft. See if I can get some, some real short, quick Lyft rides real quick. Because if I can start banging out some Lyft rides, then sheesh, I need four more rides to get that 50 bucks. Four more rides for 50 bucks. Let's see if I can do it. Because right now I'm right down the street from Tempe where that 450 is. So I got that 450 sitting down there. This lady's tripping. She's wigging out on something. She's wigging out on some dope. She's on some crack. <laughs> she walking sideways like a motherfucker. Yeah, but no, nah, but you gotta analyze this business like a business. You can't just be like, oh, I just want to get out there and just drive nonstop, dog. I'm gonna take all these drive. No, nah, because you might be making 50 cents a mile. You might be making 60 cents a mile, 75 cents a mile, a dollar a mile. When you can get $7 a mile, $3 a mile, $11 a mile, $5, 6 $7 a mile, you could do that. But it's going to take some discipline. You got to learn to not fall for them big ass numbers you're seeing on your screen. You see a $25, oh, $25. That shit might be for 35 miles. I can get $25 in maybe going five miles. So why do I need to go, you know, all those damn miles to get 25 bucks when I could just say, hey, I'm gonna go five miles and make $25. But they like, dude, we gonna send you 30, 35 miles to get that. I'm not doing that, hell no. Let somebody else do that. Maybe they live in that direction. Maybe they are trying to get to that part of town. That's a ride for them, that's not a ride for me. My rides are all these little short hops. Cause like I said, if I'm on Lyft and I'm not on no Lux, I need short trips, high dollars, that's it. I'm not taking no, oh man, you should get that $13 for that 21 miles. No, nah, I'm cool, I'm cool. Cause I can make $13 in one trip that took me like three miles. I could do that. 
So why do I gotta go that far to make the money? I don't gotta go that far to make the money. I could just sit in this parking lot and relax. Like I said, I'm in my part of town right now. This is where I live. I live in this part of town, so I'm cruising up back by Tempe. Like I said, it's almost 3.30 in the morning. It's about to start being airport runs, so I need four more trips. I might be going to the airport for less than $15 a trip, because you know I don't like airport for less than $15 a trip. I don't like taking people to the airport for dirt cheap. But this early in the morning, no traffic. If I can get somebody to the airport, get back out. Students that are going back home for the summer, whatever they're doing, grab them, shoot them to the airport, you know, seven, eight bucks, get back to where I'm going to, and just keep doing that all morning before the airport traffic builds up. Then I can see myself getting those last four trips. But airport traffic builds up, I stay away from the airport. I don't do that unless you're really going to pay me something good. Like $35 for like five miles, I'll do an airport run. $35 for 10 miles, I might do an airport run. But, you know, when you're talking high miles, oh, yeah, we're going to give you $25 for this trip, but the trip is 35 miles. I don't want it. I'm cool. I don't want it. A lot of people take that because they see in the $25. I'm looking at the, the per minute, per mile. I don't care about the $25. I can make $25, but it might take me three rides to get there, four rides to get there. But I bet in those three rides, I went three miles each. So I went nine miles to make $25, where somebody else had to go 30-something miles to make $25. I only went nine miles. That's it. So, and that's how my gas lasts forever. And that's how, you know, I keep the, the miles down on my car for the money. You can make a ton of money if you learn to keep your miles down, but keep your dollars high. I mean, you're not wearing and tearing your vehicle. The depreciation is not adding up as quick. Oh, fuck them. Ooh, I could do that. And that would actually get me down to the airport. Cause you know, there's people downtown going to the airport, 13 miles, $13. Nah, fuck that. Nope, fuck it. I'm not doing it. I thought about it too long. I was thinking about it. I was really, really thinking about it. But it was coming out to be like a dollar a mile. And I don't like that shit. I was, it was funny because I was just talking about that shit. Falling for them big numbers. Ooh, $13, motherfucker. But it's 13 miles. I mean, it's not fucking amazing. <laughs> it's like, it's, it's the standard. It's average. I'm trying to be above average. Trying to be above the standard. So I can be like, ooh, $13, 13 miles. There's people downtown right now that need rides to the airport. Now, my lift is activated, but they can throw a Lux in. If they want me down there that bad, they can throw a Lux in and be like, Jeff, we'll give you $20 to get downtown. Because remember, you paid me 11 to get here from downtown. So you always got to come better than that to get me to go back. I mean, look at downtown Phoenix. It's, it's looking pretty good, but downtown Tempe ain't too bad either. So, you know, I'm at a stalemate right now. You gonna pay me good for being down here? What? what? What are we talking about? What are we doing? We're definitely not doing that. That's how you got your fucking mind. I mean, that's 25 miles almost of driving for $21 total. Yeah, that, that's not my type of driving right there. I don't do that shit. That's not my type of driving. I mean, if you would have made that shit a Lux and said, hey, Jeff, we'll pay you $70, $65, that's one thing. But 25 miles and you wanna pay me $23? I'm cool on that shit. I'm cool on that. I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. I'm in the area I want to be in right now. I just passed another little hospital right here. So I guarantee that little hospital probably going to have me pick somebody up. Because people are always leaving the hospital. Workers, motherfuckers visiting families. Like, hey, man, I need to get home, man. I've been at the hospital long enough. I'm going to go home, check on the cats, dogs, whatever. So they be, they be out of there leaving the hospital. And I'll be right in the area, picking them up, swooping in, getting them real quick. But yeah, all those long ass fucking nature hikes, I don't take those. $25? Nah, I'm cool. Shit, $12 for 12 miles? Nah, I doubt it. Doubt it. I'm not doing that. Not doing it. We got we gotta be better than that. We gotta do something better than that. And especially at the time right now, it's 3 30 in the morning. Drivers are about to start waking up. People are waking up right now, getting ready for the morning traffic, for the uh, airport traffic and stuff like that, which is cool. But I'm not nah. I'm not doing those long nature hikes. I'll let somebody wake up in the morning and take that $25. That, that could be the first ride of the day for them. They wake up in the morning and be like, oh, man, I woke up. Got me a $25 ride right off the bat, baby. $25 right off the bat. Motherfucker, how many miles you go? 27. 
<laughs> like, fuck that. How about you hit me up when you got a $25 mile, a $25 ride for like five miles? Now we can talk. Now we can talk. But Lux, Lux is tricky, man. It's a mind game. Lux is a mind game. Like it's 3.40 in the morning right now. I'm just waiting on somebody from Tempe to say, I need an airport ride. Uh, I just lost my four dollars and seventy-five cent bonus. God damn it! They just took it from me. Yep, they took it from me. Now I'm at two seventy-five now. So they stole two dollars from me. Cause I definitely wasn't taking that shit. Hell no. I'm like, you trying to get me to go? 22 miles away or some weird shit like that. I'm cool. Hey, they gave me my 425 back. I'm back in the game, baby. I'm up to four. They, it was 475, dropped to 225, and went back up to 425. I'm like, that's what I'm talking about. Give me my money. So, hey, there's my airport right there. Bam, bam. All right, let's do that. So we're going to go to the airport first. Well, I'm right around the corner. What's up, Haley? What's good, girl? What's up? Little Haley. Let's go get little Haley real quick. So I'm going to go pick up Haley, uh, get her to the airport, just like I said. And then somebody from downtown is going to want me. So I'm going to go air. I'm going to go Tempe Airport, airport downtown. Bet I get $20 for that little hop. Watch. It's going to be 20 bucks total by the time I make it downtown. Watch. So just dropped off Haley at the airport and you can see it's surging like crazy around here Surging. This is early morning running. I can throw it on Lux real quick and see if I can maximize But I only need three more rides on lift So let's do the three rides on lift get those out the way then throw that shit on Lux Because I think after the $50 challenge what's the next level at? $15 for 10 rides. Yeah, I probably won't make that I could do that shit on Lux tomorrow so we ain't gonna worry about the $15. I wouldn't really worry about none of that shit, but since I'm so close, let's go ahead and do it. <clears throat> let's do it, fuck it, let's do it. As much as I hate to do that shit, man, because I'm looking for airport, I'm not looking for this, but I only need three more rides, so. I'll go pick this dude up, or Veronica, girl, I didn't even see the name. I'll go pick up Veronica real quick and see if I can get, it's just north of the airport, so I'm still by the airport. It's not completely horrible. It's not a horrible ride, but it's definitely not what I wanted. And it's like, sometimes, I know I'll be like, man, don't settle. I settle for this one because it's going back toward the airport and I'm just north of the airport. And this is the this is the route I want to be on all morning. I want to be downtown airport, downtown airport, downtown airport. That's the route I'm looking for. And with this ride, it at least keeps me on that route. It keeps me, you know, going east, west, east, west in a straight shot. Even though she ain't going to the airport, she's going just north of the airport. But I can always shoot back down toward the airport if somebody's in that vicinity, grab them or whatever like that. But... Veronica, you kind of messed up my plan a little bit. You kind of threw a little monkey wrench in there, but guess what? You got lucky. You lucky, because if you was going away from the airport, I wouldn't have came and picked you up. I would have declined it. If you was going to Chandler or you was going out towards your know, Avondale or something like that, I definitely wouldn't have came and picked you up. So, you lucky you going toward the area I'm going toward. So, we about to have this morning ride real quick. Let me go down here and pick up Miss Veronica. Skirt. Yeah, I'm going to go pick her up, and then I'll jump back on with my next ride. Okay, that was a pretty quick trip. That wasn't as bad as I thought it was. I'm at $174. Bucks. I'm right above $9. I'm going to shoot back down to Tempe because I'm right here. I'm going to shoot back down there and see if I can get that $9 surge. Because like I said, she's right by the airport, which is not bad. There's people that need to... They're going to try to send me north. I guarantee they're going to try to send me up to Scottsdale to pick up somebody to bring them back to the airport. So I'm trying to hurry up and get my ass south real quick. Because if I can get south, and somebody else tipped me while I was driving too. So it should be up to six tips. Seven. Two people tipped me. What? Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. 20. You kidding me. You kidding me. $25 tip? You kidding me. Wait a minute. Who did that? $25. Who did that? What's the passenger? What's the passenger? 
Steph, and it was the dude from the hospital. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Man, I appreciate that, Stephan. I appreciate that, brother. Damn, that's what's up. That's what's up. Man, hey, that just made my night, man. That made my night, Stephan. I appreciate you, brother. Man, man. I did. I had no idea. You know what? It's so many good people out there, man. So many good people out there that just, you don't know how you affect them. Me and him talked about his accident. I talked about motorcycles and how I always wear helmets and shit like that. You never know who you affecting just by having a great conversation with him. You know what I'm saying? And dude went through some rough shit. He got hit by a damn car tonight. He got hit by a car. How the hell are you getting hit by a car? Uh, $13 for 13 miles? No, nah, I'm cool on that shit. Yeah. You got to do better than that, Liv. Sorry. $13 for 13 miles at this time. Now, now, now. No. We, we trying to get up there. We trying to get up there. But anyway, Stefan, man. And, and he's going through something bad. I picked him up from the hospital. And remember, I almost didn't go. I was like, man, I hope this ain't no decrepit ass person at the hospital. I hope this ain't somebody in a wheelchair. This I went anyways. I went anyways. I followed my gut and said, somebody there needs me. It's probably somebody getting off work, whatever this and that. Let me go there and just pick somebody up. And dude tipped me 25 bucks. Damn, damn. That shit makes my heart happy right there, man, because you never know how you affecting people and how they affect me. And, and you know, I just I, I just follow my gut, man. I follow that energy, you know what I'm saying? I, you know me, I cancel people all the damn time. I have no problem canceling somebody, zero issue. But something told me to go to that hospital. Aside, damn, it's up to 12 bucks. Aside to how I was feeling, I had to get to that hospital. That's all I knew. And so I'm glad I did. You know what? That, that's pretty cool for, for my man to take care of me like that. That was pretty cool. Hopefully, I can get down here and get this $12 because this shit's crazy. Like I said, Tempe is blowing up. And I'm glad I'm not. Let's, what's downtown? Downtown ain't too bad. But I'm glad I'm close to Tempe because Tempe's apparently where the money's at. So I'm going to head down here and see if I can't get this fucking money. This is what's up. Let's go, baby. About to hit the highway. Turn tracks control off. Yeah, because if I leave traffic control on, yeah, it gets a little squirrely some days, some days. Yeah, but see, that's why they tried to, that's why, you know, Lyft just tried to send my ass away from Tempe. They see that $12 sitting there. They was like, send his ass to Mesa. Don't let him get to Tempe. Nope. I'm going to Tempe, baby. I'm going to Tempe. You just screwed up. And you better hope I don't put Lux on when I get it. I only got what two more rides before I get that money. Two more rides. It's not bad. Two more rides. I didn't. I didn't want that Mason one. Thirteen dollars for thirteen miles. No, nah, that's not. That's not what I'm on right now. That's not what I'm on. So you know how I cherry pick. You know what I'm saying. I. I make sure I pick up these little short hops. Cause a lot of people, honestly, dead serious. A lot of people, when you do these short trips, they respect you. The fact that you came and picked them up because most drivers don't like short trips they look at that dollar sign four dollars what five dollars what they be looking for 25 Ooh, 25 dollars i got that 25 dollars but that's 25 dollars for 25 miles when you can take a short trip and probably get a 25 dollar tip shit you just never know you never really know but people be over ah oh, god damn it still it's close enough 1175 is close let's go around this little car right here yeah, but you got to take them little short hops because sometimes them short hops is, is full of good energy. That's good energy right there. And so you're going to try to cruise in, get these people to, to you know, just jive with you. You're only in the car for, you know, eight minutes. It's a short trip, but you just kick into your job and you got some good combo going on, shit like that. That's all it's about sometimes. You know what I'm saying? It's not about a long, drawn out ass fucking hour trip and you're going to get like a six dollar tip nothing wrong with a six dollar tip dead serious but if i'm in the car with you for a whole hour and i know lip ain't paying me shit anyways hook me up hook me up but it's cool like i said i just took steph and you know I, and that was a quick trip it was from banner hospital to his house y'all saw it it was a quick trip but dude straight took care of me man that shit's cool that shit like i said there's some good ass people out there dude going through trauma going through trauma taking care of a driver and all I did was just chat with him, try to bring his spirits back up. You know what I'm saying? Keep him from, from really looking at the situation as, as a negative. I mean, he got his life. You know, it could have been way worse. 
I've had four motorcycle wrecks. I still got my life. That's why I live so good. Shit, I was in a garage explosion one time. I know how bad shit can get. But when, but when you got, you know, something going good, you got to cherish that shit. Be cool with that. And that's what I tried to radiate to him. I tried to send that energy to him, let him know, even though some bad shit just happened to you, man, you alive, brother. You, you on your way home right now on the Beamer, man. You good. You good. It could be way worse. You could be still in a damn ambulance or on your way to a morgue right now, but you on your way home in the Beamer. You all right. You doing cool. And my man, you know what? He, he appreciated that energy. He took care of me, man. And I appreciate shit like that. There's some good people out there. There's some real good people out there. But like I said, I'm, I'm usually a Lux driver, but driving Lyft, you know what? It, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. I've had some bad Lyft rides and I even got one on recording, not, not the video, but the audio of how I felt after it because I had to report the dude to Lyft. And this was just from last week. I still ain't put it online yet because I don't want to radiate that energy right now. I don't want to radiate that, not on Lyft, not even on myself. It was, it was a horrible situation. Dude pissed me off and I never get pissed off. But one day I'll probably put it online. I don't know when. 10 bucks, let's go baby, let's go. Please give me a ride to the airport. Please, because that's gonna be like a $20 ride if I gotta go to the airport. Well, maybe not 20, it might be like 17, because I know how they get. They be like, we're gonna fucking, you know, supplement the fare. They gonna drop the fare down to $1.50. <laughs> They, here you go, $11.50 Like, damn, man They do shit like that all the time But yeah, but anyways You know, he's a good guy, you know what I'm saying And Lyft passengers, they're not As bad as sometimes I think they are, and that's on me That, that energy's on me, that shit's on me They're not as bad as I think they are I mean, shit, some of the drivers suck I know all drivers ain't good But all drivers ain't bad either Like, all Lyft passengers ain't good But all of them ain't bad either there's some good ass energy out there you just got to make sure that you radiate that good shit and, and it comes back at you and that's all i be trying to do for real that's all you know what i love driving cars because i used to work on these motherfuckers all the time and it's cool that i don't have to be up under them you know draining all the oil and shit non-stop i could actually be out enjoying this engineering cruising in this motherfucker you know trying to have fun in it one day i might open up, up my garage again but in the meantime, you know, I'm just I'm just kicking back. I'm relaxing right now. I'm just enjoying life right now. Enjoying meeting people, you know, helping, you know, inspire people to do good shit. People inspire me every day to do good shit. And so it's kind of like we bounce energy back and forth off of each other and we trade that energy. And hopefully, you know, we affect the next person in line. So I appreciate you, Steven, man. That, that was some cool shit you did, brother. That was some cool shit you did. Okay, let me turn. I'm gonna go park somewhere. All right, I'm in Tempe right now. I'm going to park on the side of the road. It says no parking, but guess what? Ain't, ain't nobody out but me. Shit. It's just me, me, myself, and I, baby. 10.50. That's what I'm talking about. Keep that money going. All right, now I got to go in here and make the Wi-Fi activate. This is usually how I activate the Wi-Fi. I'll go hit this button here. Boop. Look at that. All right. And now, go back here. I know it's a whole process I go through, but what I'm doing is I'm screwing with the phone, making the, making the phone like have movement. So the app think, hey, he's doing something. Look at that, ain't shit going on on Uber. One out of 50 for 90 bucks. I could have did that, but like I said, Uber, man, they don't be sending enough good rides. Uber sends a lot of shit. Like Uber X is good for a lot, but if you want a lot of short rides, oh, they, all your short rides are gonna be like, you know, Sometimes it'll be like three miles for three dollars and they'll just keep sending you three miles They will never send you like three miles for like six bucks because they don't throw enough surge out there for you And and lift those you some surge out there at least to turn those little three dollar rides into six dollar rides So it kind of helps you a little bit But uber x uber x is good for for that price variant shit Like let's say it's eleven dollar ride and nobody's taking it You can you can end up getting like twenty dollars for an eleven dollar ride Or you might get a six mile ride for like sixteen bucks on uber x so that's what I hope for with them. But since this was my week to do short shit, to get a lot of short hops, I mean, hell, I'm not doing crazy shit. I'm only going to do short rides. So lift is what it is. Let's see something real quick. Uh, how many hours have I been out for the week? 11 hours and 50 minutes. 546 
in 12 hours. In 24 hours, you can make over a grand. 48 hours, over two grand. And that's it. Like I said, I've been online for 21 hours, but y'all know how I do. I don't care about that shit. I be sitting, chilling. I be at home. I was cleaning my pool, and I had the goddamn app running. <laughs> and I didn't even know it. And then she said, bling, bling. I was like, oh, shit. But yeah, they be throttling, too. So they'll throttle you every once in a while. So five i've been online for five hours a day because like i said i didn't get started today till like 10 o'clock at night so shit happens I, I needed some sleep so i just slept uh 10 50 let me go in here real quick let's piss them off because you know how i do lux so now they're not gonna send me shit because i got lux on right now and so what it'll do is it'll it'll make them see me as an available driver, but on an upgraded platform. And they'll be like, why can we not have a driver on a lower platform? Why do we have to have this dude on this upgraded platform? And you know what they do on Lux. Y'all seen that shit before? They'll sit there and have me with a $20 surge riding around for two hours on, on Lux. I know how Lux is. So Lux is my pause button. I'll make the motherfuckers kind of kick back for a second, relax. And so the moment I get on lift, they'll be like, oh shit. We got a driver. We got a driver. He's on Lyft. He ain't on Lux no more. And so that's kind of what I'm doing right now. Let's let the surge build up a little bit. Man. Ain't nobody going to the airport at 430. Can we can we not get some, some activity going? Oh, I got a funny feeling the moment, the very moment I put this shit on Lyft. They're going to try to send me up to Scottsdale to pick up somebody to bring them back to the airport. I guarantee that shit going to be like, like 23 miles for $24. <laughs> and it's going to piss me off because I'm going to lose that 1050. And I'm like, hey, do this 23 mile ride for $24. I'm going to be so fucking mad. But that's the kind of shit they pull all the time. All the time. Okay. What do we got? What do we got? I'm hoping for a short one. Just something just straight to the airport. That's it. The longer they wait, the more they screw themselves up. Ooh, wait a minute. You know what I can do? I can put Uber on. Nah, they're gonna make me take a picture of myself. Y'all wanna see this shit? This is what they do all the fucking time. They be messing with me. Motherfucker gonna be like, nope. <sighs> okay. They always fuck with me because they be like, why does this dude keep going offline and online, offline and online? Because I can. So, I'm gonna turn the recording off, get me some gas, then I'll get back online. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna take the shit. My bad, bro. But pickup is... No, I don't want this fucking ride. Fuck that $10. I'm not gonna sit up there and do no goddamn, you know, fucking nature hike. Fuck that. Like I said, now I got six. Okay. Because I'm not doing no, no goddamn dollar a mile ride when I can do better than that. Just stand in this area. Sorry about that shit, man. For real. I really am. But Lyft, Lyft set you up. They said because they know who I am and they know how I am. So Lyft did that shit to you, bro. I didn't do that. Because they, they can look at my account and say, hey, this dude ain't doing no fucking long rides. But yet they turn around and they get this dude this fucking ride. They say, oh, yeah, Jeff will take you. No, I won't. And y'all know I won't. Y'all did that shit on purpose because y'all knew I was going to decline the shit. And y'all didn't want to pay the 1050. Fuck it. Keep the shit. I'm just gonna go right back up here, get the 825. And that way, I don't gotta worry about that shit. Cause right now, even if I go get another small ride, I'd rather get one. I do not want to burn all that fucking time and fuel. A dollar a mile, that, that's like fucking 40 minutes of driving. And that's far away from my house. I gotta come back. I'm where I live right now. This is where I live. So that means I gotta go 20 something miles up the fucking highway and 20 something miles back down the highway for twenty dollars for twenty eight dollars really it was eighteen dollars because that ten fifty was mine that was my fucking bonus so for eighteen dollars you're gonna send me twenty something miles up the highway and then twenty something miles back forty something miles for eighteen dollars 
no, nah, I'm cool on that shit. No, nah, I'll cancel that. No, nah, I don't do that shit. Don't play me like that. Like I said, I'm, I'm an easy going ass driver, very easy going, but I'm smart too. I know how to make this fucking money. Look at that 1075 up there again. I'm gonna go back and get that shit. I'm already at 950, already at 950 bonus, and I ain't even did shit. Look at that. Who the fuck do these motherfuckers think I am? They out their goddamn mind. It's like, fuck no. No. Y'all out y'all fucking mind. I'm not doing no goddamn nature hikes this time in the morning. Still no. Wait, that's the downtown? Mm, nah, because y'all not giving me enough for that shit. Like I said, I got a $9.50 bonus, and that's what y'all paying me to go downtown? Like I said, y'all, I made 11 just getting here. You can do better than that. I mean, make it at least $20. Shit, minimum $20. I know they mad as hell. Now they like, dude, he's on a rampage. This motherfucker's canceling rides like crazy. Are like, you fucking right? Don't do me like that, man. That shit's not cool. It's like, I know how to operate this app. I know what miles to dollars is and shit like that. I know about all that. So don't think you're going to just throw a big ass dollar up on the fucking screen. Like, hey, Jeff, $28. Like, yeah, for 50 fucking miles of driving damn near, I'm cool on that shit. No, I'm good. Give a fuck about your 20. I can get $28. I can just do short rides. Hell, I just got a $25 tip plus $7 ride for a little short ass trip. So why the fuck do I want $28 for all that when I could just do a trip like this, just find somebody around this area, do a trip like this, get $32 in four miles. I can get $32 in four miles. Well, it really was about five because I was about a mile from them. So 5.6 miles, $32. But you want to give me 28 for 25? Fuck no. No, hell no. It's like, I don't think they realize the type of drivers that we are. We are, ooh, 1325. That caught my attention. <laughs> but they still, they not going to give me shit. They, they be messing with me. They be messing with me. I already know it. But I'm one of them drivers that I don't care. You could... Throw all the surges you want on my phone. To me, it ain't shit but numbers. And if the numbers don't make sense, I'm not taking the ride. So you could put, just like when Uber do that shit, they'll say, hey man, here's a $20 ride with a $15 surge on it. And the ride is 20 miles. I like, wait a minute. So that means you giving somebody $5 for 15 miles then. Because if it's a $20 ride for 20 miles, but you got a $15 surge, that means you're paying somebody $5 to go like 15 miles, like, no, no. Nobody's falling for that shit. It's just numbers on the screen. That's all it is, a bunch of numbers on the screen. You gotta break that shit down and be like, do these numbers make sense for a driver like me to take it? Am I gonna take $28 to drive 25 miles when I can get $32 to go four miles? Think about it. I'm where the money is. Why would I leave the money pot to drive 28 goddamn miles down the highway somewhere. I'm going to leave the money pot for that? No, you got to pay me more. You got to pay me like 50, 60 bucks. Like the one time they gave me the 138 to go to 50 miles. I was like, cool, give me the 138. I'll do it. For 138, I'll do it. But other than that, I'm not doing it. No, I'm cool. I'll cancel that shit. Decline it, whatever. I'll get rid of it. I'll get it off my screen and let somebody else deal with the numbers because the numbers don't add up for me. Not for the type of driver I am. And I'm not saying I'm some incredible ass motherfucking driver. I'm some amazing superstar ass driver. No, I'm an accountant. I have a degree in accounting. I know what numbers look like. I know how they relate to each other. And if the shit don't make sense, I'm not touching it. I mean, if I ran multi-million dollar corporations and shit like that, casinos and all that shit, you don't think I can do this shit for like ride share? This is ride share. It's delivering fucking tacos. It's driving people around. I can figure the shit out. It ain't that complicated. But don't sit up there and, and make us look like dumbasses saying, hey, we're going to give you $25 to go, you know, 30, 40 fucking miles round trip. No, I'm cool. I'm cool. I did this. Let's see what they talking about. I could do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Yeah, but that's what it was, though. Like I said, I'm not. Oh, we got credit union. Cool. Yeah, but that's how I drive, though. I'm averaging $2 a mile because I just made about $800 off of one tank of gas. Well, really less than that because I get 400 miles for a full tank. 400 for a full tank. I was on 61 miles till empty, and I just filled up again. 
and I'm done. Like I said, I got this ride and one more ride and I'm done till Thursday. Unless I want to come out tomorrow. I'm done. I don't have to drive till Thursday if I don't want to. So you got to do this shit smart. 70 bucks just made me $800. And that's how I drive. I don't do a lot of miles. Even on Lux, I don't really drive a lot of trips on Lux. I be canceling everything all the time and shit. Because I don't like screwing around with people. So if, if the money ain't there... I'm, I can't do it. I'm sorry. I'm just that type of businessman. I'm sorry. And I apologize to people I be canceling and shit because they probably one day going to see the video be like, dude, that was me on that ride. He fucking canceled me. Dude, I apologize, man. Dead serious. I am. But don't take that shit personal. That's not about you. It's about me. That's, that's me being fucked up canceling that shit. That ain't about nothing you did. That's Lyft fucking with me and me saying, Lyft, I'm not dealing with that shit. So don't think it has nothing to do with you. You know, I, I respect you, whatever. If you ever watch this video, don't be like, dude, I'm the motherfucker you canceled. I had to get to work that day. I was late. Dog, my bad. I'm sorry about that shit. But let me fucking with people, man. And I'm one of the people that I don't like left messing with. So, you know, I, I'm going to use this bonus right here. Go pick this lady up. Drop her off. I got one more ride after that. And that's it. I'll probably be out for the morning. Okay, I just dropped off Miss Sweet. And actually, she was pretty cool. That lady was real cool. She was pretty sweet. She was actually a sweet lady. And let me see, where's the activity? So that was her ride right there. That was her ride, this one. It was a 661 ride with a $13 bonus on it. So I went, you know, I was about a mile or so away, went and picked her up, almost 20 bucks. You know what I'm saying? Almost 20 bucks for six miles. And they were trying to give me $28 to go like over 20 something miles. They were trying to give me all, you know, hey, Jeff, here's $23. Hey, Jeff, here's $25. Here. But it was over 20-something miles for each trip. I can get that with six miles. So why do I want to go over 20-something miles with a surge when I could just go six miles and get the same amount of money? You got to know how to work these apps. The shit has to make sense. It has to make sense. If it's not making sense, you're not making that many dollars. You've got to make it make sense. And like I said, I could have took that $28 ride. I'd still be on that ride right now. I'd still be on that ride trying to make this $28. Because like I said, that shit was a shot way out. That was over 20 miles. I'd still be on that ride right now. I've already made the $20. I'm done with the ride. And it was only six miles. That's how I like to drive. A lot of people see me kick rides out like that and they don't know why. There's a reason why I kick rides out like that. Because it's not worth my time. I got my time back now. I'm on my time now. I'm not driving Terrence across town. No disrespect to Terrence. Like I said, it's not you, brother. I appreciate you. I'm sorry for canceling you, but I'm not driving you across town right now. I just dropped Sweet off. That was a quick ride right there. It was 10 minutes. 10 minutes, I just made 20 bucks instead of damn near 45 minutes making the same amount. I saved myself 35 minutes of time. And I could go sit in the parking lot, I could chill, I could, you know, make my little YouTube videos, I could do whatever I want to do. I just saved myself 35 minutes for the same amount of money. So, that's that's why I drive the way I drive. It might not make sense to people, but it's cool. It ain't got to make sense to you, it makes sense to me. And I'm the one that's got to make this money, I'm the one that's got to drive. So as long as it makes sense to me, and as long as the way you drive makes sense to you, can't nobody complain. I make these videos to let people know you can use any tier out there to make good money if you understand the tier understand the surges understand the bonuses understand the market like where you are i understand downtown i understand tempe i understand those areas i understand scottsdale which is why i stay the hell away from it because i know it's crazy crazy traffic until they get the infrastructure built for ride share up there they don't have the infrastructure for ride share Going to Scottsdale is kind of like going to the stadium on game day. It's it's may it's just mayhem. It's chaos. It's crazy. So I don't like doing that shit. So I stay away from it on chaotic times. Now I go to Scottsdale in the middle of the day because everybody's up there eating, playing, hanging out, doing shit. It's not chaos. It's cool. But how long have I been online? Let's see. Been online for 21 hours. Hey, like 12 hours. I made 566. 566 to 12 hours i can make over a thousand dollars in 24 hours it's possible like i said it's possible i'm not one to do that shit but i'm saying if anybody want to take a shot at it knock yourself out i'm not one to do it but i'm just north of a surge i got one more ride before i make that money so i'm gonna make 600 dollars literally in 12 hours if i can get this last ride real quick
that's that's six hundred dollars on the app six hundred dollars on the app in 12 hours and that means in 24 hours two days of straight driving I could potentially make twelve hundred dollars like I said potentially I'm not say well I could do it because no it's a lot of shit a lot of factors are involved hell y'all see me make a thousand in a day see me make eight hundred ninety nine dollars in a day but I'm saying, you know, on a routine basis, no events, no nothing, just straight being smart about driving, you could potentially make $1,000 in two days of driving. You don't need to take four days, five days. No, you could do it in two, but you got to be smart. You got to know what you're doing. Cool. I just hit that bonus. All right. Sorry, pigeons. Get out of the way. Almost hit them damn pigeons. Yeah, but there's a way to do it, but you want to have a consistent basis of doing it. And I've been driving all week, so I made the 566, about to go over to the 600, 600 plus other 200, so it's about $800 so far. And that's just, like I said, that's that's $800, and is that 800? I don't even know what the hell I made on Uber. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's see, I think it was 199 I made on Uber, I think. Let's see. Yeah, so 200 bucks. So 200 bucks on Uber plus 600 on, you know, Lyft on app, you know, so 800 bucks. And that's just 13 hours online. Woo, that's horrible. I've had Uber running a lot. I wish they showed actual drive time with Uber because they don't they don't show you drive time because they just want they want to trick you. And I know how that works. They they want to say, "Oh yeah, well you drove this much drive time with Uber." I'd be online like, "You go 5 minutes to make 6 bucks." You know, here you go down here three minutes to make eight dollars like i said my drive time with uber is real low because i cherry picked the hell out of uber seven minutes seven dollars four minutes I, I cherry picked the hell out of uber 11 minutes seven bucks 18 like I said, that's 15 miles right there for 29 dollars because i mean i had an 879 tip but that's kind of how i do sometimes you know what you gotta you gotta cherry pick and know how to do this shit the right way before you let these apps take advantage of you and everything. Oh shit, that was my upside. Wait a minute, let me go back in here. Oh my god, I just got gas. I just got gas. Okay, got it. I paid. Yep, already paid already. Not now. Not now. Alright, so I just paid for that gas, got that money. So I'm headed right now back to my house because I only need one more ride. So if anybody can get me to the airport, close to the airport, cool, let's do it, let's do it. I wish there was a way that I could do, you know, a full day with Uber, but like I said, Uber, psh, man, they, they whack. Uber's whack with some of their offers. They, they will drag you on forever. I did 18 rides on Saturday, not bad. 18 rides on Saturday is not bad. 21 on Friday in seven hours. Jeez, man. And that's seven hours online. 21 rides is almost three an hour. Yeah, about three rides an hour. Here, it's about the same. About, you know, three rides an hour. Just about. But, yeah. You gotta get out there and get it. You gotta get out there and get it. I gotta cash out. As soon as I finish with this ride, I said I cash out all the time. So it's 194, I'm gonna add that. It's gonna be 254 once I add that uh, 50 on there, plus the next ride. It's gonna be about $254 sitting in there. So the 254 sitting in there, I'll cash that out because I don't leave my money sitting on these apps. Hell to the no. And I be cashing out all the time. After every night, every night, cash out, get your money. Don't trust they ass for nothing. Cause you'll wake up one day and you be like, this account has been suspended due to suspicious activity. Like what, what the fuck are you talking about? You gotta argue and fight just to get your money out. By the time you get your money out, your bills are past due. And now you got past due balances on shit and you gotta pay a $10 fee on all the past due balances. I don't mess with them. I don't even give them that option. It's like, nope, cash out real quick, be done. No, but that lady sweet, she was pretty cool. She was actually pretty cool. Like I said, I, I wish her luck. You know, we all go through stuff in life. What are you doing? What are you doing? Let's take it. And I'm done for the day, damn it. Nine miles for 10 bucks, and that's with the surge on there. That's how janky they are. They did that shit on purpose. They really, now watch the next ride they're gonna give me is gonna be quick as hell. I guarantee it's gonna be so damn quick. 
Because they just wanted to screw with me. They wanted to get me away from going home. They sending me away from my house now. Idiots. But guess what? I'm going to go out there and I'm going to sit at the gas station. I'm going to get somebody to bring me to the airport. I mean, I'm still not that far from home, but it's the simple fact that these fools knew I was headed home and they sent me in the opposite direction. But I'll do it, get it out the way, whatever. I'll hit y'all back up in a second. Okay, so I finally did that. So for the day, it's looking like I got $6.10 because I got the $50 ride challenge. Yeah, yeah. But that was that little quick hop right there I just did. So he was only six miles, like I said, a couple of miles away, about 10 miles for 10 bucks total. There you go. Well, it was really, yeah, it was close to 10. It was close to 10. And that's what I got on the uh, the week. You know, I did how many hours? 12 hours, 24 minutes. Came out with 626 bucks in 12 hours of driving. Not bad, not bad. Plus you had the 200 from the other, so you got $830 and couple of less than two days of driving pretty much you got 12 hours on one probably about 12 hours on the other one but not really 12 because like i said it was 13 hours online on uber so 13 hours online i probably cherry picked that's probably about you know three hours of driving total because <laughs> as you can see out of 12 here is 22 is a 10 hour difference so when you cherry pick you kind of sit in the house and you kind of scout a lot and get rid of a lot of crap so really, it's always, you're gonna have a lot of variances in your online time versus your driving time. But you're not using no fuel up, you're not using no time. One tank of gas basically made me close to 850 bucks on the app. So that's not bad. One tank of gas cost me 70 bucks, made me about 850 bucks. So off one tank of gas, I think I can make a thousand bucks off of one tank of gas. That's my goal, is to use one tank of gas, 400 miles, to somehow make a thousand dollars i think i can do it that dollar a mile shit is is not for me i think i can do better but it's gonna take me a whole bunch of cherry picking to get there and i don't mind that i really don't because like i said as long as i ain't at the gas station i'm not running miles on my car i don't have to drive that many miles to make a thousand bucks i can drive 400 miles a week to make a thousand bucks you shouldn't have to drive 50 cent a mile at 2,000 miles a week just to make a grand if you driving at 50 cents a mile and you out there saying, oh, I made a thousand bucks, but you driving 1,500 to 2,000 miles, it's, it's not worth it. It ain't worth it. Because it's, you're, you're being very inefficient on how you're cherry picking. And I know a lot of people say, well, you know, it's less time, it's less time. Actually, more time and more gas at the same time. Because I didn't basically, if I'd have took that $28 ride, that $28 ride, I mean, this took me, what, 15 minutes, and then the ride before that took me, let me go back to activity, the ride before that, come on, thing, took me 10 minutes, so that's $19 right there, $19, and then the other one, when it pops back up, there we go, and 10, $29, $29, I went six miles, Come on, thing, quit screwing with me. Six miles, and then I went five miles, 11 miles. So let's say 12 miles. Basically, I went 12 miles to make 30 bucks when the other one was paying me like $28 to go like 25 or something weird like that. I don't even know. So you're making the, you're making the same amount of money, but you're driving twice the distance. You gotta learn how to cherry pick. You gotta do it the smart way. You can't be out there burning all this time, burning all this gas. You can do less time, less miles, and come home with the same amount of pay, which means less expense, less wear and tear on your vehicles, less tires, less brakes, less fuel, less oil, less of everything, just by being a smarter driver and doing it a different way. That's all, and I got the 50 bucks. So, I could drive some more this morning and make more money, but I'm like, you know what, I'm, I'm over it already. I'm over it. I'm gonna go home, eat some of this barbecue. It says I'm in the surge zone and everything like that. Six dollar ride, I don't care about these rides right now. Like I said, that's where I am. And my house is right about there, where it says Contempo. So I'm not too far from home, I just dropped him off. I'm done for the day, I'm cash out. Go up in here real quick, cash out of this money. Confirm deposit, we're done. And that's it. 
So there we go. It says $325 more and I hit my goal for the week. So I can wake up, I can drive Sunday to make the goal. But like I said, I made money on Uber. I made about 200 bucks on Uber, so it's not real bad. I could go do a little bit because my goal is to make like $900 a week. I think that's what I got it at. Yeah, 950. My goal is 950 bucks a week. And I know a lot of people say, why do you only want to make 950? You want to make like $2,000? No, I don't want to do that. This little dog. Somebody's dog is roaming the streets right now. What the hell? Yeah, that's somebody's dog was just roaming the street. Everybody kind of hit brakes. Yeah, but, you know, if I can make $950 a week, that's almost $52,000 a year. And if it only costs me 70 bucks a week in gas, just think, 70 bucks times 52, $3,500 to make 52,000. So you're basically profiting 50 grand a year. 50 Gs a year you're profiting off of working part time. But then you still got to worry about, you know, brakes, depreciation, shit like that. But cherry picking, you can walk away with 50 grand a year because you ain't blowing all that shit in gas. And you only working part time. I think it's a win win. For me, it's a win win. I don't want to work 80 hours a week. I don't. I don't even want to work 40 hours a week. I really don't. I mean, if I'm working 12 to 20 hours a week, I'm cool. 24 hours a week, 30 hours a week, I'm cool. I don't need to be working no 80 damn hours to have a living. I can make a living just by using my brain. And that's what I'm trying to do. Use my brain, make a living, do this shit the smart way, make this money, and be out. Go home, eat me some barbecue. Because I barbecue yesterday. I'm going to go home, eat me some barbecue right now. So I appreciate you guys for watching this video. For the ones that watched the whole video, much love and respect to that. I know it gets kind of long, but you got to watch this shit in sections sometimes. You got to watch a little bit today, a little bit tomorrow. It's kind of how it works. So, peace. I appreciate you guys listening. I'm on my way home to eat me some barbecue, baby.